Hey guys, my December birch box just arrived and I'm so excited. I wasn't expecting it to come today, but it was on my doorstep and this month's got a cute little gift tag on it. So I'm really curious to see what is inside of this box because I haven't been completely thrilled the last few months of birch box. So let's see what we got. The box this month is uber adorbs. Look at that. Love the print on the front this month. And I don't know how this always happens, but my nails always match the box. I swear to God, I did not plan that. <laughs> so when we open this up, got our card inside. This month's theme is all wrapped up. So there it is right there. Looks like we have four products inside and a lifestyle extra, which are all listed on the back. I'll put all the details and the full prices in the description bar for you guys. And here's the reveal. That's what's in the box. So I'll start with the little, looks like a fragrance sample. It's Nicole Richie Eau de Parfum. And I think the scent is just called Nicole by Nicole Richie. You can see it's got a little pump top there. Let's try it out and see what it smells like. Ooh, that's a familiar scent. It kind of reminds me of Sensual Amber from Bath and Body Works. If you guys are familiar with that scent, it definitely smells like sensual amber. Nice fragrance for the holidays, something a little bit different. I don't usually go for the muskier scent, so I'll stick that in my bag for the holiday season. This is the Lifestyle Extra. This is a dark chocolate peppermint fortune cookie from Emily's. Looks pretty nummy. Got this cute little gift pack in here this month to unwrap. So we've got gold stripey tissue paper. The rest of our samples. This is from Juice Beauty and it is a CC cream. So CC stands for color control. This is a stem cellular repair CC cream. And it says that it's better than BB cream. 12 in one multitasking, repairs DNA damage, evens out skin tone, uh, anti-aging, rich in antioxidants, SPF 30, and it looks like it was in two shades this month sent out so you either got natural glow or warm glow and I got warm glow so it has a little bit of a tint to it yeah, let's see what the color looks like it has kind of a moussey texture to it I don't know if you guys will be able to see that Ooh, sorry I don't know there's like a lot of weird things going on with the color balance green tree red couch me in the middle so sorry if you guys can't see that but it actually does look pretty subtle and I think it's gonna match me pretty well so I'll let you guys know how I end up liking that we have two foil packets these are from Karastase Karastas. I'm probably saying it wrong, but there it is. Bam. Two foil packets. This is a resistance cement thermique protect, which is supposed to be a leave-in protectant for when you're doing heat styling. It's supposed to help condition your hair as well. I'm super, super not a fan of these foil packets, especially when there's like creams inside, hair care products. They just seem to end up all over the package and all over the container I hold them inside of, but I'll give them a shot. I have been using a lot of heat styling lately and my hair has been a little frizzy, so we'll see how good it is as far as moisture and frizz control. The last thing in the box is this little guy. This is from The Balm Cosmetics, and it is their Merry Luminizer. So this is a highlighter, shimmer, eyeshadow, uh, three-in-one product, basically. But I know this is really popular. Oh my god, how cute is this? Look at it. It has a little trap door. Boom! Although it does kind of look like somebody's thumb has been in this already. Not mine. <laughs> I don't usually use highlighter and PS. We got a highlighter last month in Birchbox. Well, I did anyway. I got the Stila one. Um, so I'll probably end up using this as a highlight for shimmer eyeshadow, just like they suggest, because I think it's a really neutral, pretty shade. So I'll definitely use that as an inner corner highlight or even on my brow bone. And in the bottom of the box, there is this gift card. This is $50 off for Rent the Runway. So let's see if it's actually $50 off. See, this is one of those cards where it says $50 on the front, and you're probably like, oh, I've got a $50 gift card. But on the back, it says $50 off $125 or more. So I will check out the website. I've never purchased from them before. I've kind of heard of it, but I don't really know what it is. So we'll check that out. 
that was everything in my box this month and I'm pretty happy I would say that the value was definitely there for ten dollars I think this month was probably one of the better ones for me anyways the last few months like I said in the beginning I wasn't really thrilled with what was inside but I'd say four out of five of the things inside this month I was pleased with the only thing I'm a little eh on is the foil sample packets but the product itself is something I will use and seems like it's a good thing so we'll give it a whirl and see how it goes and if you guys got a birch box this month make sure to leave me a video over response or a comment so I can see what was in your box because I've only watched one other unboxing and my friend got totally different things than I did this month and she was not happy at all so I'd really like to see what the variety was out there this month if you guys were thrilled with this holiday assortment or what I want to thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video bye